Today's Five Things You Need to Know is brought to you by Power Credit Union, proudly serving Southern Colorado. I'm Rob Cork with this News 5 Now update. Looking ahead, Pueblo County Commissioners will meet on Thursday to discuss proposed transmission line towers between Pueblo West and Fremont County. Last month, they asked for more time to collect facts and legal advice. Black Hills proposing running 39 miles of lines from Pueblo West to Canyon in order to meet power demand and lower costs with those substations in Pueblo West, Penrose, and Canyon City. But community members are speaking out concerned about the negative impact on the environment and wildlife. More precautionary COVID-related isolation quarantine in Academy School District 20. One staff member in isolation, 36 students from two separate classes, along with nine staff in quarantine at Woodman Roberts Elementary. Another staff member, a class of a dozen students in isolation at High Plains. The district waiting for COVID test results. None of them have tested positive yet. High school football will not return to Colorado in the fall despite getting the green light from the governor. Chass's board of directors voting unanimously on Tuesday night. Stay with the current plan to delay until the spring. The board noted player safety, not undermining return to learn models, student involvement in other activities. Some of the issues for that decision. And your Pueblo Chili Watch, farmers taking the wait and see approach before assessing any pepper damage from the storm. Farms on the Mesa tell us the good news, the chili crop didn't freeze. They're more concerned about the weight of the snow on the plants. Let's talk about that weather. Here's Mike Daniels. Rob, that summer snow did bring a nice drink of water to the tender dry, uh, dry vegetation here across southeastern Colorado in the springs. Most neighborhoods picked up about two to five inches of snow, an inch and a half in Pueblo. The foothills just loaded up with that wet, heavy snow. In Beulah, nine inches of snow. You melt that down into liquid. It was an inch and a half of water. The big winter, San Isabel and West Cliff, up to 14 inches of snow. Thank you for listening to today's five things you need to know. Sponsored by Power Credit Union.